Aloha from the Ozarks, folks. I've got a 12 by 32 corner porch cabin right here behind me. We make an excellent little tiny, uh, do-it-yourself tiny home project or an excellent little hunting cabin. So I'm going to turn the camera around and let you take a look at this pretty little building. Just a second. Here it is. This is a, like I said, a 12 by 32 corner porch cabin. So it's got the little porch rails. This one's painted with a white trim and your metal roof. The paint comes with a 10-year adhesion warranty and a 25-year warranty. Uh, you got porch rails, you got a 36 by 80 nine light window. It'll come with four windows that are two by three single panes. Uh, let me go in inside this building and show it to you. Before I get started talking about the, uh, this building, I wanna encourage you to take a look at this video description. Click on that so you can see and read the entire video description because I'm gonna have links in there. A link to view my current inventory, which will include this building and any other building that's on my lot. It'll have a link to uh, my frequently asked questions playlist on YouTube where I go over answering a ton of questions that people usually ask me. Uh, it'll have a link to message me on Facebook and there'll be a link to like my Facebook business page where uh, if you like that you can get updates whenever I have new buildings like this because I post videos and, and pictures and things like that. Alright, so please encourage you right now go ahead and look at that video description and see all the links. Uh, and and uh, if you have questions, you know what to do. You can message me or read my video, uh, Frequently Asked Questions uh, YouTube link. Okay, now let's talk about this building. Um, Graceland, by standard, we put in 5 8 inch plywood in our walls and floors. First thing that I hope you notice that's different about our buildings compared to any of the other portable building manufacturers out there. Most of them don't use plywood in the walls or floors. They use an OSB wall and a composite floor. Next, in the walls, 16 inches apart are our standard two by four wall studs. 16 inches like you would build in a home. Then we double them up every four feet. We use more wall studs than just about any other portable building manufacturer out there. And that means more wall studs means a stronger, sturdier wall. Most of my competitors space them out 24 inches apart <clears throat> instead of 16, which means they use fewer wall studs. And then some of them do not double them every four feet. Next thing in the walls are the windows and they are double frame, double um, two by four. So keep that in mind when you're shopping around. Other, <coughs> excuse me, other companies don't necessarily double reinforce their window frames or their door frames, but that's standard in Graceland. Double reinforced, I wanted to show it to you. And what that means is that the window and door frame is gonna stay square with the building. So when it's on your site and level, windows and doors should open and shut properly. A lot of my competitors uh, save themselves money by only putting a single 2x4 uh, instead of a double reinforced 2x4 on the windows and door frames. Okay. Next, at the bottom of the wall, single reinforced 2x4 and a double reinforced 2x4 at the top of the wall. And then you'll notice that our uh, roof trusses are anchored using a metal hurricane clip at the top of the wall. So many of my competitors don't double reinforce at the top, but we do. Okay, most of my competitors don't use a metal hurricane clip to attach their roof trusses, but we do. That's how we're able to offer you part of the reason why we can do 150 mile an hour wind gust certification on our buildings. Big strong gust of wind comes uh, and at one of my competitors buildings, since they don't use metal hurricane clips, it could pull that roof right off of there. But because we use the metal hurricane clips, that's why we say we got 150 mile an hour wind gust certification. That's part of the reason we do that. So at the top of the walls, I wanna show you one more new thing. Uh, this is an aluminum soffit ventilation system and it runs along the side wall of every Graceland building. So all the way across here is that soffit ventilation system and all the way across here, soffit ventilation. That's for improved airflow and air circulation. It's a Graceland exclusive because we have a patent on that. Um, in addition to that, we put in a screened in roof ridge vent across the top, screened in to keep out bugs and debris, but it also improves your airflow. And you combine the roof vent at the top with the soffit vents on the sides, you get a building that stays 10 to 15 degrees cooler in the hot, humid summertime. Next, I want you to look at the roof trusses. The roof truss is a giant triangle that spans the entire width of the building. Now, you may not have ever paid attention to that before, but when you look at my competitors' buildings, notice that the size of their roof truss is a smaller triangle, and then they just extend a wing out to the left and to the right side. Our triangle spans the entire width of the building, makes it a stronger, better roof truss. We use only premium two by fours, premium grade of lumber. Many of my competitors do not use premium. They buy a cheaper grade of lumber. We only use premium and they're two by fours in the roof trusses, two by fours in the wall studs and the floor joists underneath are two by sixes, premium grade. And by the way, everything that you're looking at lumber wise is pressure treated and it comes with a lifetime limited, but a lifetime warranty. Most of my competitors do not offer a warranty like that because they don't use, first of all, they're not using plywood in the walls and floors. Second of all, 
the lumber they're using may not be pressure treated, but ours, all of it is, and we only buy the premium grade. Okay, back to the roofs. The uh, decking on a roof is 7 16 OSB roof decking. A lot of my competitors don't use a roof decking. They use little one inch wood slats and then they space them out every so often on the roof so their roof is not as strong as ours. These roofs are like you would build a roof for your own place, okay? On the outside of the roof decking is the metal roof and between the metal roof and the roof decking is a, radiant, or is a moisture barrier. Now this particular building has an optional upgrade of what we call our G-board radiant barrier inside the roof. I highly recommend that for any building that's going to be used as a do-it-yourself tiny home or a hunting cabin. All right, it reflects out 97% of the sun's radiant heat, so that makes a huge difference in the hot summertime. But it is an optional upgrade. It is standard in this particular building that they sent to me, uh, but it, it doesn't have to. Uh, we can custom build one for you without that if you want, but I always encourage you to get the radiant barrier. Now. Um, Let's take a look at the floors. I forgot to mention to you, 5 8 inch plywood on the floors and they're tongue and groove. So that means the plywood slabs are interlocked together using tongue and groove. So it's really a seamless gapless floor. Bugs that are underneath this building cannot get up through the seams inside the building because of the tongue and groove uh, interlocking plywood slabs. Okay, Underneath your 5 8 inch plywood floors are our uh, 2 by 6 floor joists. And a lot of my competitors use a two by four wall stud as their floor joist, but we do not. We use two by six, so it's a bigger piece of wood, a stronger subfloor. And like our wall studs, they are spaced 16 inches apart down here in our, in our um, floor joist, okay? So that's standard for if you were gonna build a home, you would build it similarly to that. that you'd use tongue and groove on your floor, you'd use two by six floor joists that are 16 inches apart. All right, so Graceland builds a better quality building and they stand behind it with better warranties. Roof is a 25 year warranty. Your premium pressure treated plywood everywhere has a lifetime warranty and we offer a seven year warranty on workmanship and the majority of my competitors only go five. We have that better warranty because we build a better quality building and we stand behind it with better warranties. If you are interested in this building, the cash price is always your lowest price. We also offer rent to own with no credit check and there's no penalty to pay it off early. So I always encourage you to pay it off early. Uh, free delivery and set up within 50 miles of my lot means we bring the building to you, we set it up on your concrete blocks that you provide, and then we level it, and then we anchor it down into the ground as long as you block it up at least eight, 18 inches high. All right, if you have any questions about this building or you would like to get, you'd like to buy this one or get one custom built for you, all you gotta do is message me on Facebook or send me a text message. Aloha from the Ozarks. And by the way, before I go, I wanna remind you, look at this video description and see all the links that are in this video description. Aloha from the Ozarks.